Two of the most common questions we get about portable AC units are, why does water collect in my unit? And how often do I need to empty the water bucket? The good news is you may never have to empty the water bucket. I'll get to that in a second. Before that, let me tell you why water collects in the first place. As air cools, it loses its ability to hold as much water. So this excess moisture is collected in your AC. As the moisture builds up, some of it is automatically evaporated and released through an exhaust hose. Notice I said some of the moisture. There are two types of portable ACs, partially self-evaporative and fully self-evaporative. Most portable ACs are partially evaporative, so let's talk about those first. Partially evaporative ACs evaporate a large amount of moisture, but some water still builds up and needs to be emptied from time to time, depending on the humidity in your environment. The most basic way to get rid of this water is to manually drain it. Simply remove the drain plug and allow the unit to drain into an empty container. How often you'll need to do this depends on your humidity and how long you run your AC. It can be anywhere from six to eight hours to several weeks. A lower maintenance option that's available in select units is to use a drain hose. Simply attach the drain hose to your AC and run it to another location. Keep in mind that drain hoses rely on gravity to move water, so you won't be able to drain vertically or through a window, but it's a convenient option to avoid manual draining and is especially popular in basements with floor drains. The most versatile draining option is a condensate pump. These let you drain water up and out of an area without relying on gravity. Most people who use a condensate pump guide theirs outside a window. Fully evaporative ACs remove all collected moisture, so no water builds up inside the units, meaning you don't need to drain them. Here are some brands with fully evaporative ACs. That covers your draining options. In the next video, we'll talk about how energy efficiency plays into choosing a portable AC. See you in a few.